John and Tammy in the morning as we are welcoming in brand new artist Gloriana. Welcome to our show. It's hey. awesome hey. to have you here. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and throw it out there. It is so bleeping cold outside. We're almost, <laughs> we're almost embarrassed yeah. to have you here. Well, we're, we're from Nashville, so it's a little bit cold there, but it does not even compare to this. Nin- it does not. It does, you know what? You can leave now knowing that you're tougher right. than everybody that, else. This is true. This is true. I Actually, I haven't seen snow uh, in a while. Tammy, long- on an absolutely freezing day, wind chill right now is b- 20 below zero. Wind chill. Two below zero actual temperature, and Gloriana is with us in studio wincing at those words. You guys have a story now. You can go home and tell all your soft friends in Nashville. <laughs> oh, my gosh, it's 42. It's 42. <laughs> it's a traffic jam uh, that you guys were actually here in one of the – and this is this – is, not usual. This is unusually cold. And we can all take it because we've lived here sure our entire life. Sure it is. Yeah, this is unusually cold. Trust the, me. The hard part for us, we had no uh, warm-up to this. Like, we were in Tampa last week, and it was yeah. like 80. It was oh, yeah. like the middle of summer. From, straight from so, heat you know? to this. Well, actually, we, we stopped over in Nashville to shoot our first official music video. Talk about that. Oh, yeah. That was, that was awesome. Actually, it was a, it was a, it's a summertime uh, kind of video so it was cold in Nashville it was like you know 30 35 degrees or whatever and they're like you can't act like you're cold <laughs> yeah we're shooting outside we're like shivering they're like okay act like it's warm we're like oh god we actually did a car scene too where Rachel drove this 1977 uh, International Scout down Broadway in Nashville they closed off the street for it. Cool. And yeah. cool but we had nice. the windows all down so they could throw uh, them yeah. in yeah, yeah. and I, I mean, Cheyenne and I were in the back seat it was like not quite like this but I mean it was cold you know <laughs> the point because we did it for like hours they're like stop shivering all right so now you know inside scoop when you see gloriana's new video you can know that they're actually freezing (laughs) and it was not summer at all in nashville and it was funny too because we um we had this big party scene uh in the in the middle of the of the video and you know they've got all these cute extras you know these kids they looked like they all walked out there was abercrombie and fitch ads there was one girl wearing like a doily or something these girls these cute little summer outfits i felt horrible for them. because we had to keep running out of the house like like, we're all, like, leaving the party. Woo! Don't you hate and people like that, And they're all just like, oh, God, we're freezing. And we're all like, run back in, do it again. Yeah. Like, well, out. at least she looks cute. Yeah. That's, That's why our road manager, Anthony's job was to keep the extras warm. If you know. <laughs> nice. Nice. Just the man for the job. Anthony's here with us, lusting after a picture of Whitney Duncan, who is <laughs> yeah. nicely done. Uh, now, if, if you guys, uh, obviously, in groups before this, doing your own thing, have you ever uh, gotten close to the success that you are, are 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 feeling now, I mean, it's it's exciting to watch you guys, the four of you guys now, because you can see that you're onto something. You know it. Um, it's cool to watch that. Have you ever been in something else that was almost as close, like you're filming your own video or Start on that uh, Cheyenne? <laughs> yeah, go down the line. Here. Everyone's pointing at you, Cheyenne. Yeah, I, I did. I, I shot a music video and I had an MTV show and all that fun stuff. So I got to do a radio tour, but um, it's actually way better. Doing this with three other people. Our producer Angie. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off, Cheyenne. Our producer Angie comes back. And says, ah, Cheyenne's familiar. I've she's, she's either been here before. I've seen her somewhere before. Is it the MTV show? <laughs> yeah. Is that what it was? Oh, okay. All right. Well, see, I, I've been here before. Um, no, but I, like I said, it's it's so much more fun doing this with three other people that are just as passionate as you are. You know, and and sharing the same dream. It's it's just better, and it doesn't get as lonely on the road. So <laughs> it's cool. Go ahead. Um, for me, I had a publishing deal in Nashville when I was 15. So I was flying back and forth. And as soon as I graduated high school, I moved straight to Nashville. And um, I didn't end up getting a record deal or anything. But I, I mean, I was kind of struggling at one point, And, um, you know, I was doing a solo singer songwriter thing. And then finally, the guys came along. And everything just started actually happening for us. So this is all this is all fairly new to me. So we uh, we played at this really cool wedding one time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was fun. Yeah. It was good. They had great food. Great food. Yeah. Were you guys wedding crashing it? Uh, kind of. We only <laughs> yes, had to pay were, them a little bit it. to let us play. So it was pretty <laughs> open bar, right? Yeah. No, we uh, Mike and I, like I said, we played for about ten years in the southeast. Pretty much almost every day of the year kind of a nightly thing. We kind of lived the dream for a while, you know, and uh, made it to Nashville, found the girls, and uh, we're, happy. we're lucky. Everything, yeah, everything's golden these days, man. This is great. It's been such a fast track for us. I mean, being only a, for a band for, like, what, a year now, it's gone so fast. We've already been signed to a label, made a whole entire record, and shot a music video and started our radio tour. You know, it's it really has gone so fast for us. We're well, really lucky. And you're on John and Tammy on Star Country. Exactly. Yeah. That's got to be on the Pinnacle. list. Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, I want to hear more live music from Gloriana. Tom, Rachel, Cheyenne, and Mike, what are you going to play for us now? Uh, this next one is one of our favorites. Uh, this is called The Way It Goes. Shy, I'm sorry. Gloriana. <laughs> I'm still. Oh, really? No, I'm really? Just... Cheyenne. <laughs> he's, yeah. he's googly eyed over no. here. Uh, he's, uh, he's, uh, and let me just say something. He's drooling and it's starting to freeze. It's turning into an icicle. <laughs> it's a droolsicle. It's, it's, it's an attractive look, isn't it? No, I was mad at myself for not knowing the MTV show you were on. So now I have to ask because I'm going to sound like a really unhip old man. But what, what show was You would have never known by the name. It was called, uh, what was it called? Oh, yeah, Cheyenne. <laughs> uh, really? It was, three year, it was three years ago. I was 15 and it was, it was only eight episodes. So okay. It's just a little thing I did. Interesting. Yeah. All right. I haven't like, watched MTV in eight years or in three years, so that's cool. That's all good. You didn't uh, miss anything. Thank you. Thank they, you. They used to play these things called videos. Isn't that crazy? It was awesome. Yeah. I remember sitting on my buddy Jeff Hans's couch because he had cable, and they'd either play like Duran Duran, Hungry at the Wolf, or Judas Priest, You Got Another Thing Coming. Rhythmics. Uh, oh, the Rhythmics. Yes, yeah, very good. And now Gloriana. I'm sorry. The song you're going to sing is again? The Way It Goes. And it is on Star Country with John Tammy <laughs> and Cheyenne in the morning.